Good morning, you guys. My name is Tristan Stewart. I am a student here at Vanessa High, and we had a job fair today. Look, I'm Coach Wilcox, and what I want to tell you is this career day is amazing. These kids that used to be here, like Tim, Tim is one of those guys who were in the Army. Jones right here, they're in the Army. These guys were, 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 were students here for me in the gymnasium. Listen, they're doing great things right now. Tim is an amazing kid. He always was. And listen, going to the next level where he's going now, he'll always be somebody because he always knew that he could be somebody. Tim, I'm, it's great seeing you, bro. It's great God. seeing you, man. Great. So listen, so kids, you can always become something in life. Whether you look at yourself now and you think that you don't have something, you can be somebody in life. I promise you. Just put forth that effort. Give everything that you got for whatever it is that you want to do. And you can make it. Staff Sergeant Crenshaw with the U.S. Army. So some of the benefits that we're given, we have opportunities full-time and part-time. So that's Army and Army Reserve. If you want to get out of here, go somewhere, learn a trade, I would say full-time Army. If you want to stay local, go to VSU or Wiregrass or something like that. You can go Army Army Reserve, serve part-time, it's like one week in a month, two to three weeks, somewhere throughout the year, they have to show up to the unit. Other than that, they give you money for school. If you score good on the test, they give you even more money for school, and then student loan repayment as well. So you can learn trades through the Army, you can get some certifications, take it with you to the civilian side, and make a little more money that way. But at least you're getting your education taken care of on the front end through the military. So that's some of the things the Army can take care of. Janet Strickland, and I do the hiring for our local Wendy's franchise. We have nine stores between um, Adel and Lake Park. We are starting all of our employees out at $9 an hour. We do have tuition reimbursement for dual enrollment seniors. We also do tuition reimbursement for any of anybody that graduates that attends Wiregrass, Georgia Military, or BSU. We've been around in this area for 46 years. I was actually an original crew member 46 years ago. So it is the same family that's been operating this franchise for that long. And we've, we've had lots of good people come work for us and lots of people that are still with us that have been able to move up in the company. We've always got those type of opportunities available. My name is Joshua Barnes, and this here is my partner, Clifford Greer. We are the owners of Barnes Greer Funeral Services. Uh, we're here today to uh, shed some light on what we do, uh, being funeral directors and bombers. Uh, we'll just let the, the kids know that uh, the process of embalming and some of the steps of disinfecting, preserving, and restoring human remains uh, to be safe and be pleasant for the viewing and for the funeral services of their loved ones. We also have here uh, a casket that we brought with us, an embalming machine. Machines, also some instruments that we use and uh, embalming fluid and also a urn. A urn. Um, this, this profession that we that we deal with is looked upon sometimes as being grim. We just come to shed the positive light on what it can be and, and the impact it can make on the community. Thank you. So Walker, the United States Coast Guard recruiting up in Jacksonville. I'm here today at Valdosta High School advertising for the Coast Guard. A lot of people don't know what the Coast Guard is, but we are a military branch. We're Department of Homeland Security, we're not Department of Defense. So that just pretty much means that we're in the business of saving lives, not taking lives. We got a couple different options that you can do. Uh, you have a four-year option, so when you come to the Coast Guard, get your education paid for. We have tons of jobs that you can do to actually transition back to the civilian side. Since we're Department of Homeland Security, all our jobs do transition back to the civilian side versus the, some of the other military branches. You got a 20-year option that you can do, which is you come in at the year of 18 years old, retire as early as 38 years old, and you get your medical benefits paid for for the rest of your life, a free paycheck for the rest of your life, and then obviously your college education program. Say if you want to come in to do a college scholarship that we have, it's called C-SPY. All you have to do is maintain a 2.5 GPA. We give you your housing allowance paid for, your books is paid for, your classes. You get $3,600 a month, free medical, and when you graduate, become an officer. Um, so that's all I have today about talk about the Coast Guard. You guys have a great day. Hey, it is Stevenson, the doctor of conductivity. You know all over for Nissan of Valdosta, keeping it tight, keeping it right, hanging out with the one and only BJ, and I gotta tell you, we are happy.
happier than a fat boy with a pocket full of cookies. We're hanging out at Valdosta High School, BJ. Have you ever seen anything like this before? Nah, it's wonderful. It's Man, it's like great. 400 kids out here. Yeah, why not? So, so, BJ, what do you have to say to anybody who didn't come out today about this event? They sure messed out on a great event, and Valdosta done a good job. I'm telling you, hey, it's the Dr. Crontivity for Valdosta Nissan. You know, the only place where we hook you up like a tow truck, the only place where everybody gets free oil changes for life, the only place where everybody rides. Come holler at your boy, Stevenson, keeping it tight, keeping it right, hanging out at Valdez. See ya. That was some clips from my job there. I hope these jobs really benefit you guys in the future if you have to pursue them. I hope you have a wonderful day.